How to Win the World Cup in Pyjamas by Kobe Nin and Mary Nin. Hi, my name is Emma. The World Cup is very hard to win, but I've won it many times in my pyjamas. And that's why I'm giving five tools on how to win the World Cup in your pyjamas. Tool 1. Work on developing grit. Winning the World Cup starts years before the actual championship. Write down some goals. This keeps you motivated. Then practice, practice, practice. And when the going gets tough, reach within to find your inner drive. Tool 2. It's good to perform your usual rituals. The morning of the World Cup, be sure to eat your regular breakfast. Go outside to breathe in the cool, fresh air. Hanging outdoors can relax your mind. This makes you comfortable and boosts your confidence. Tool 3. Walk to your backyard or driveway and visualize the field. Smell the turf below your feet. Dribble the ball down the field. Feel it listen to your every command. If you make mistakes, no worries. Stay carefree by focusing on your performance and not the outcome. Tool four, use mantras like work hard or right here. Take some deep breaths like a dragon and think of your strategy for the next pass. Doing this helps to keep you focused. Tool five, keep up the positive body language. Bounce up and down on your toes. Stay confident and upbeat. Have good posture. Now fire past your opponent and take your shot Watch it curl in. Can you hear the crowd roar? Relish in your newfound victory. Thank those who have helped you. If you think of any more tools, write them down. I'm going to get ready for soccer practice. The end. We hope that you loved how to win the World Cup in pyjamas. Why not buy the book and read along? To find out more about authors Kobe and Mary Nin, just click on the links in the description below.